What's going on everybody? Tech here, Geek and Microsoft has reversed their policy on the uh, DRMs and the used games policy. A lot of people are saying they did it because they got so much bad press because of it. And me personally, I do believe that because when you come out kind of with this little smug attitude talking about, well, if you don't have an internet connection, go to the Xbox 360 and if you ain't on a... a what did he say? A, a Navy SEAL submarine when you got no access to the internet, just stick with the 360? Like, how could you come off so smug like that? And me personally, I do believe that the bad press from all that made them, had made them change their mind. They see the reaction of the consumer saying, we don't like how you coming off, and so we ain't going to even buy your system. So, I believe it has something to do with it. So, but, you know, a lot of people are saying that the Sony won E3. And it's not from what the games they showed you or the hardware they showed you. They they pretty much told you what they want you what you wanted to hear. We will play used games. We ain't always connected to the internet. We ain't got no restriction. This and that stuff you want to hear when you buy something you want it is it's yours. It's not no, it's yours for the temporary time having it. But you gonna do what we tell you to do. Don't nobody want to buy nothing like that. But that's pretty much how Microsoft is coming off. And it's kind of seemed like they're making the same mistakes Sony did with the PlayStation Three, where you coming off. You have success with your second console, and all of a sudden you come around the third time around, you feel as though you can just charge anything you want because y'all going by regardless because we are who we are. And that's pretty much that little policy they went with, and that's why I think this is going to bite them in the, in the foot because what they should do, in my opinion, is that have two systems, one without the connect, one with the connect. This way, give people a choice. Don't force the connect on people. Tell them this is what you want, where they probably don't even want the connect. So... But, you know, they pretty much changed their um, policies and on the used games. Now you can play used games across the board and it's un region, uh, region locked. It's unregion locked. So you can, if you buy a game in Europe, you can play it on your 360, mm, 360, Xbox One here in the United States. So they had to change they changed their policy. Some people say it's be it was because it's on. I believe so. That's, that's just me saying it. But some people may think differently. But that's my opinion. But I want to see what you guys think. Please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Please rate and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys later.